Hey, first graders, welcome back to our Google Classroom. I'm Mrs. Gillardi, and I am so glad that you are here. We are so close to the finish line, but we can't give up yet. We have to keep working towards our goal, towards second grade. And I had a blast last week doing all those fun camping things. I hope you did too. It was unbelievably fun. There was so much that involved learning, and I bet you didn't even realize it. Well, I had a great time, but now it's time to get into this week's learning. So I'm gonna share my screen with you to show you what we are talking about this week. Now, if you remember, uh, two weeks ago, we talked about Bossy R and we learned all about AR together and how they made that R sound like a pirate. Well, today we're learning about ER and ER says er. Well. How many words do you think have that er sound? More than you can possibly imagine. Let me show you how. Well, today you're gonna to be watching a video, the long vowel pair ER sound song. And today we are also going to be looking at some slides. So let me show it to you. Nope. Let me share my screen with you again. Okay, so take a look at the word spider. Here it is, let me blow it up so you can see it right in the middle. S-P-I-D-E-R, spider, er. Well, that er has to be spelled, even though you don't hear it, with an E, spider, E-R. And there are so many words that have that E-R spelling. Let's take a look at some of them. All right, let me shrink this down a little bit. We have water, hammer, tiger, do you see how all these words are ending? That's right, with the E-R, that bossy R takes over. And you don't hear the E, but it's there, okay? Let's take a look at some more words. What about baker and shower? And here's one that's in the middle of a word, germ, germ. They all use that E-R spelling. We have dinner, we have butter, they're all spelled with ER. That bossy R is always there. Now let's take a look at our activity for today. Today we are going to be uh, looking at um, making ER words. We're going to add the ER. And then what we're going to do is we are going to rewrite the whole word, adding the ER. So that spite is going to need an ER, spite er. And then we're going to write the whole word all over again. And if you want to challenge yourself, you can write sentences on the back of the page using these words that you made with the bossy R, E-R spelling. Okay, so those are uh, the activities that we're going to be doing today. We're going to be learning about E-R, watch that E-R video in the um, phonics classroom, and then you're going to work on that worksheet. So I will see you back here tomorrow. So we'll learn a little bit more about E-R and we'll learn about more bossy R spellings later this week. I'll talk to you later. Bye.